one. And finally, Musselman will clear the blue line. McNabb jumps the boards, as does Hughes. Stajan stays on the ice. Big hit by McNabb along the boards as Newberg took the brunt of that one. Boy, Newberg gets up slowly and makes his way back into the play. Chris Parr throws it deep. Watch out for Newberg. <laughs> Pair off. Oh. Newberg with a huge hit, and he'll get a penalty. And jumping in on that one is John DeGray. Peroff jumps up as well, and you're right, partner. Watch Newber. He was just looking for that big elbow and threw it behind the battalion net, and Kenny Peroff got rocked. Well, Newber was hit along the boards here on the near side by John Hughes, and he got up a little groggy, and he was looking around who hit me, and Newber was just going to go at anybody in a white shirt, and he nailed Peroff in behind the net with the elbow. Watch this, bang, right in the face. And Peroff has a little gash, I believe, around his nose area, and he's chirping at Newber. More to come here. John DeGray, of course, the captain. Look at Newber come in, big elbow on Kenny Peroff. And DeGray, the captain, the leader he is, jumps right on Newber. So we'll see how the minutes shake out, but right now the battalion are down. Two big defensemen and John DeGray and Ken Peroff with Newber sitting in the box. We'll see how the minutes shake out, if it works out to an even uh, scenario or not. But right now, with 13.20 to go in the second, what a huge hit from Newber, and not a very legal one at that. The big elbow came up and clocked Kenny Peroff, and uh, that's just one of those uh, cheap shots that you don't want to see happen. Well, here's the hit on Newber at the around the half board. You see, it was a pretty clean hit. Newber more or less got his, his skates tied up a little bit and he's looking at the ref and he's saying and you can see him getting up and he's saying man who hit me there and I'm going to tackle somebody here. And it was John Hughes who hit him along the board so it's not yeah. like Hughes is known exactly. for the big checks. Yeah it was a relatively clean hit and we'll see Newber here on the on his reaction. Kenny Peroff taking his man out. Newber coming in, and he just has him lined up. He's seen his head down again. And, man, that's an elbow. That's he could have put his shoulder into him. He decides to put the elbow into him instead. And we'll wait and see what happens here. We talk about cheap shots, and you know what? That, shot, that check is eerily similar to the one of Steve Downey's hit when he was with the Philadelphia Well, Flyers. the only difference is I don't think Newber went off his feet. Yeah. But... Uh, but Newber certainly had the opportunity of putting the shoulder into him. And that's just being emotionally <laughs> wound up there at the time we're getting the hit there. He was looking for the call on Hughes. I don't believe he even know who, who hit him along the board. Well, you there. called it as soon as he got up. You called it. You said, watch out for Newber because he had that look in his eye, that eye of the tiger kind of thing where he was going to go out and get somebody. Yeah. Mark my words now. When they get out of the penalty box... You'll see Mr. Musselman on the ice every time Newber's out there. So, Peroff has moved from the penalty box back to the bench. So, Kenny Peroff, there you see him putting his helmet back on on the bench. And it looks like Newber will be sent off the ice for the remainder of the game. Well, there you go. As we sort this one out, Newber is going to the dressing room. We'll wait for the official announcement. You see, and that's what a young hockey club, uh, you know, the majors aren't that young, but nonetheless, you get a shot like that, you're down 5-1. That puts your hockey club in a real predicament now. I don't know what they're going to end up here. He's got a five-minute penalty here, so Brampton, as lethal they are in the power play, is going to, you know, put this one away this afternoon and took all the chance out of the majors coming back into this hockey game. Yeah, we're going to go... Uh Probably four on four for the first two minutes of that power play with John DeGray getting a two-minute minor and a five-minute penalty and a game misconduct going to Kyle Newber. <laughs> Referee in charge of tonight's game, uh, Mike Pierce over-explaining things to Dave Cameron, the head coach of the Mississauga St. Michael's Majors. And that's just frustration kicking in for the Majors. Uh, big win down in uh, Windsor on uh, Thursday night in overtime and then getting uh, shut out 
in Plymouth on Friday night. And, of course, Brampton taking it to Mississauga this afternoon. You knew Brampton was going to be up for this hockey game, Doug, because of what went on Friday night in Sudbury. They were looking for six points. It looks like they're going to get five points on this three-game trip. Trying to... Not the best at it, but trying to read Dave Cameron's well, lips. Gray, the gray has been sent off yeah. as well. They're trying to read Dave Cameron's lips. Is why is that guy not getting a five-minute penalty? So Luke Lines has gone to the box to serve the two-minute minor for John DeGray. We're still waiting for someone to come over and serve the penalty for the majors, and that should be Dylan O'Neill, number six, and O'Neill is coming over. Faceoff will be outside the battalion blue line. Stage and in Larson to take the draw. So things have all settled down and both players were kicked out of the game for the rest of the 13 minutes. The battalion losing a huge defenseman. Lars